Okay, we'll get started with uh, login and project creation and settings. In Wakari, you can manage accounts in two ways. You can have a local database within Wakari of accounts, or you can integrate it with LDAP. I'm going to log in here. The first thing the user sees when they log in is their project, what we call the project dashboard. Um, this is a listing of the projects that they own, and also a listing of projects that they might be contributing to. In this case, this user has one project that they've already created. We're going to uh, create a new project here. Simply create on the new project button, and our name, maybe a little title um, or summary of the project that you want to put in there. You can make it public or private. Uh, public projects allow other people to see some of the content of the project, um, pro uh, content that you specify, and they can see it in a read-only uh, fashion. If it's private, then only members of the project can access it or see the project at all. Uh, go ahead and create this project, and we'll see now we're in the project and uh, we have access to the, all the applications and, and we can um, begin working on the project. I'm going to show how we change some of the settings in the project. Um, jump back to the dashboard. Let's go into this other project, uh, go into its settings. Um, this one doesn't have a summary. Let's go ahead and say uh, this is P1 summary. And then we're going to add a description of this project. I'm going to call this, I'm just going to take some text and Put in here now. This this uh, the description supports full markup on the project, um, which basically means we can uh, do some light markup like this, and you can see what that looks like. And allows us to annotate the project, add some like README content for anyone that might want to be a member of the project and come here. Go ahead and submit that, and save that to the project. Um, go back in. I'm going to add some team members to the project. Uh, we can add as many team members as we like. Um, anyone that's added as a team member then has full access to the to the project, the contents of the project, and can contribute to it and add to it. And they'll see it on their dashboard as soon as they're added. Uh, with the admin functions, we can make it public or private. From here, we can delete the project completely. And there's a little bit of information about the project. If we go back to the project page now, we see that our description's updated. And we have some team members on the project now. And uh, there's some public content um, in the project. Uh, right now, there's just a little README file that you get there by default. That concludes this demo of Wakari Enterprise. For more information, check out our other videos and websites.